Hello Roger, how did you find our industry briefing today? Well, I really enjoyed starting with the round tables because it was fascinating to listen to why people had come and the kind of problems they were grappling with every day uh, in using data, acquiring data, sharing data. Um, I sat at one table and for a quarter of an hour just answered questions around uh, data protection issues, which was which was intriguing. But there were lots of other discussions about how people get could get data out of out of their systems and actually make it meaningful to them. Wonderful. Um, and what would you, what would be your key message for people to take away with them from today? Well, it, it seemed to me I would say two things, um, and that is that people need to kind of look more strategically at the data they have buried in their organisation in different systems and actually try and pull it out so that it's available in kind of a management information system and that might be about measuring marketing activity, it might be about managing front of house and salary sales uh, and other activity, it about, might be about how the organisation's performing if it's a presenting venue for galleries and museums, it might be about their visitor behaviour and salary sales uh, etc. And it seemed to me that that was one of the things that lots of people were wanting to get but were seeing hurdles in getting that information uh, useful to them. And the other thing, uh, which is something that I do keep talking about, uh, is the, is the realisation that in this difficult situation, with these cuts, uh, with the need to work smarter, the biggest growth opportunity is to try and get those infrequent attenders to come back and attend more often. They've already been, they've already found our arts, arts organisations, they've found our venues, we simply have to get them engaged so they come more often. Wonderful, thank you very much Roger.